Ife Lawyers, in collaboration with Law Students Society, Obafemi Awolowo University, and Equity Chambers of Faculty of Law of the institution, recently honored one of their own in person of Professor Wahab Egbewale's son, who was recently appointed as the 11th Vice-Chancellor of University of Ilori. Mr. Shola Ujutalayo's son, who delivered a lecture titled Beavers, A Game Changer or Mirage, chronicled electoral processes in Nigeria and linked it to recent events with the hope of letting the audience understand what to expect in coming elections and the role of Beavers. The chairman of the election of the Independent National Electoral Commission, Mahmoud Yakubu, reassured us over and over again that they are ready for the elections of 2023 and there's no going back on the use of uh, Beavers. And I, will, I ask the question again, the big one, is Beavers a game changer or mirage? It is safe to conclude, as regard to the substantial success recorded in the course of using the Beavers at elections, about four of today, even though there were minor, minor breaches, but substantially, those exercises came out successfully. So I would recommend that we must do everything to support Haider in the use of Beavers. Malam Yusuf Ali, son, in his presentation, also talked about the requirements of the law during an election and encouraged politicians to do what is right before, during, and after general elections. The very good thing about it is that we are taking the position for a long time since 2015 uh, that when the number of voters existed the number of accredited voters, it should count as over voting. Professor Abiola Sonny San, while hailing the introduction of beavers to the electoral process in Nigeria, talked about other aspects of our electoral process that prevent the conduction of smooth elections. See, even when under the 2010 electoral law, INEC did not have that power. INEC started, uh, introduced technology device ahead of the reform. And then we move until we have beavers. But the, the query I want to ask is, all these are with regards to federal election and election into the state house of assembly. What is happening to the local government election? Professor Wahab Egbewale was full of gratitude to God and the organizers of the event. Well, we thank God and I want to thank the uh, students, the fellow lawyers, the equity chambers for this great honor and appeal to them to continue to be law abiding, to continue to face their studies and uh, look forward to a situation where one day they will also be honored like this. A portrait was presented to Professor Egbewale and awards were presented to deserving recipients. Muyi Olumide, NTA News.